What's up, I'm Anuma Naki, and we're starting a new game called Ra, Realms of Ancient War. Um, I've just been having a craving to play a uh, dungeon crawler. Um, so this one looks like it's pretty short. Um, let's get into it. Do a new campaign. Okay, so the way I'm going to pick my class is that I rolled, or I pulled up like a random number generator on Google, I typed in 1d6. I got a three. So I know there's three classes. It looks like wizard is the first one. I kind of wanted to play wizard, but I, I rolled a three, so the way this is going to work is the wizard is one and two, and then whatever's next to the right is going to be three and four, and then the last class is five and six. I rolled a three, so that's going to be the, I guess, warrior. That is the last character that I would want to, that I wanted to play. I was wanting to do like wizard, and then after that, I would have preferred rogue. Yeah, and then warrior is the last one, but it is what it is. Fate decided for us. Powerful and tough, the warrior is an expert at melee fighting. He can use the best weapons and armor, but has limited range attacks. Becomes even more dangerous when he is injured. Typical barbarian rage type of thing, it sounds like. Uh, okay. I. We'll go with heroic. The continent. A land divided into four cardinal realms, where humans, dwarves, and elves used to live in peace until the advent of chaos. For reasons forgotten by all, the continent was locked in war, driving the inhabitants to slaughter each other for almost two decades. As the war bogged down, the northern king petitioned for a truce and summoned the kings of the east, south, and west to the Temple of Heroes at the next solstice. The other kings answered his call and headed to the sacred site in the hope of finding a peaceful outcome to their conflict. Shortly thereafter, the three kings returned to their lands haggard and injured. The Northern King was never to be seen again. On returning, the kings proved incapable of speech and remained prostrate, absent of spirit. Although their return put an end to the war, no one knew what to do next. Since that time, the realms have been left to their own devices as the 10th anniversary of the summoning of the kings appears on the horizon. Cool. I like the, uh, I like that cinematic. It's like there's static parts to it, but also moving parts, and they, like, overlay each other. A horrible dream with hordes of hideous creatures attacking the village. The fever must have made me delirious. The injuries... The bandits inflicted on me the last time they attacked the village must have been much more serious than I thought. I'm feeling better now, though. It seems the morning patrol already left the village. It must be somewhere outside of the camp. Let's try to find them. Okay. Can we not go in there? Ooh. Instantly getting some armor and coins. It's cool. And I'll definitely... Ooh. Uh, what is this? Kind of audio. Okay, S for skills. Dual wielding. You know, the basics of dual wielding could like moderate damage on a single opponent. Next would be several enemies. So that's cleaving right there. Okay, that's cool. It says charge, hold dual wielding, short time. Let's see here, two on the special floor. Okay, cool. Berserker as a passive. Reduces incoming damage, so that's really good to get. There's another passive. More efficient mana usage. Um, faster healing, it looks like. Pull enemies into melee range. Um, okay. Probably is a. I'd imagine that I'm supposed to 
or it'd be a good idea to get this whole chain of abilities. Okay, so yeah, this is this is like a leech right here. This is really good. Prison resistance and small XP bonus. Okay, that's definitely something that I want. <clears throat> is this one powerful technique creates field of blades generating a large amount of damage? Oh, neat. Sounds like uh. Sounds like uh, like World of Warcraft, the rogue um, dagger attack, AOE. Natural gear for trading. So this is good for for trading, obviously. It's like it says, summon allies. Okay, cool. Okay, pet. More gold. Better chance of finding items. Cool. Uh, small chance of resurrecting without using a soul stone, so I guess there's something in this game that helps you revive, and uh, if you don't have one, you gotta restart? I don't know. You're killed while this buff is active. Okay, so it's, it's a revive, um, saving grace type of thing. Okay, so this summons copies of me, I guess, and reflecting incoming damage. So this is uh, thorns, it sounds like. Okay, cool. Guess I'll talk to this person. Don't forget to pay respects to the gods. What do you got to say? Feeling better? Don't worry. Careful, we're already short on soldiers. Okay, excuse me. Is there... How do I pull up a mat? Can I not? Oh, okay. Open options, controls. Quest is Q. And pause. Show compass. Maybe that's what I'm looking for. Let's see. Nope. That doesn't do anything. Spiders everywhere these days. Okay, I really wish there was a map. This is a little bit annoying. What is this? Oh, this is a soul stone, okay. So I have three revives, it seems. It's over here. Not as much fish as there used to be. Gonna be a problem soon, no crop can grow on this island. So that's not good, this place is not gonna fare well, I guess, for food. Let me look at this again real quick. Oops. This is damage to a single person, and this is smash the floor with your weapons. Great. Okay. Sorry to talk to this guy. Uh, Alright. Warriors two types of it, and there we go, it's just telling us how to do it right there. Press to unleash a combination of quick moves, or hold shift while fighting to force an attack or switch to the skill. I saw some wrap some flowers from the forest. Weather's really bad this season. Gods must be angry. Daughter did something. Escape, okay. So the first uh, dungeon crawler game that I've ever played was uh, Dark Alliance 2, many years ago. It was really good, and uh, probably been my favorite of all time. Merchant just outside camp. He gets poisoned. Okay. All right. Anyways, after Dark Alliance 2, I of course have played Diablo 3, Path of Exile. Actually, that one's probably my favorite of all time. Very intricate. I'm not really good at making my own builds, though. Um, very fun game nonetheless. And... And, um... Torchlight, you know. Uh, but I wanted to play this one because it doesn't look too long. Um, so it'd be pretty easy to just get right through it. 
Uh, okay, and this is a checkpoint apparently. You have up to nine soul stones. <coughs> yeah, I'm uh. Oh, that's a compass then. Okay, more powerful enemies display their own HP gauge. Oh man, I'm doing lots of damage. Ah, okay. What does one do? Oh, cool. Well, level it up already. Um, increase your impact to the close range. Now I'm gonna go with this cleave. Wait, what are these two again? Reduces incoming damage. And, okay, yeah, I wanna get cleave first. Get your attributes increased. Hit I. Three available tabs. Okay. Um, got a treasure chest right here. Blue leather leggings. Is that need to be level three. Okay. What is this dude doing here? Okay, I'm killing the spiders, they're threatening my shop. Here's a reward, plus discount. Cool. Uh, so this is his over here. So I'm gonna sell that, because it's the same one that I have already. And a sword for 140. What do I have? I've got a 72 to 88. Uh, it's not that much better, so I'm just gonna save my coins for now. Choppy. Oh, cool. Checkpoint. Oh, God. Okay, bandits. Well, at least my health regenerates over time. Why does my compass keep disappearing? It's kind of annoying. I'm already halfway to the next level. Pretty quick.
and an ambush by these bandits. Since this is kind of a mindless game, I may not be talking too much. Um. Oh. Oh, I just got poisoned. It was it was trapped. Okay, I can't use that quite yet. Like that's the way I need to go. No, here's a checkpoint, so I'm gonna clear this out first. Oh, yeah, there's, there's a dead end over here. Case, it's a case. Or just is it just uh, to sell it? Yeah, I can't click it or do anything else. Well, that's okay. Oh, I didn't realize how much mana my right click took. Compass says to go that way, I'm gonna explore this way first. And we're gonna get uh reduces oh when you have less than 50% life. What is this? Deadly grab and fast healing. Okay. Do I need to have all three here to unlock this? Maybe. But we're gonna do this. And then the next one prevents more blows from landing and increases your speed to let you deal. Oh, okay, cool. That's actually cool. And what's maybe this is the right way. Hold up. I get the leech ability. This is ridiculous. Okay, here's another checkpoint. It's incredibly annoying that there's no mini map. What is that? Oh, it was, okay, that was my like, passive that just brought. Experience. 
Probably some hidden chests, I suppose, but uh, maybe it would just be better to keep following the compass. Oh, this looks like a boss, yeah. Not really a boss, but just like a more dangerous breeder. <laughs> ah, well, we got a magic ring out of it, so... Guess we'll keep exploring everywhere. Uh, 36, 34... 2... Oh. Two stamina. What is this? Magic ring for HP regen, three strength. I'll do one scroll. Okay, so looks like we are gearing up. Tower is burning for your sake. I feel the heat from here. I shouldn't get too close or burn me badly. So must have fallen in an ambush. How to look for survivors. Look at this kid. Rest in peace, my friend. Strong soldiers on the morning patrol. Where are the others? That's what these wolf skins are for. That'd be really neat. Hmm. Did I already come up through here before? I think so. Oh, here's a on then. I wish the compass would stay. I don't have to keep toggling it. The monsters respond? Could have done so much damage. Bandits would have looted the bodies, but the equipment is still here. What happened to them makes no sense. Well, obviously, they got killed by some kind of creature that has no use or need for equipment. Body besides that, nobody besides them. The wolves already started to feed on them. There are no clues. Let's try to draw their attackers away from the village. Barrel of goods. Barrels filled with 
semi-precious goods. Okay. Captain Marcus's corpse must have fought until the very end. I'll avenge your old friend. What are these things? This creature that wants for my nightmares can't be real. Whenever I kill one, they're always one of the way I'll be able to hold them off. Long. Oh, well, yeah. Am I just gonna get overwhelmed? Ah, what do I do? <laughs> Portal across through before it fades. Oh, I'm getting... Lame. That was really stupid. That was incredibly, incredibly dumb. Uh, okay. After you're attacked by a horde of mysterious creatures, a voice echoed in your head asking you to go through a magic portal. You finally cross through portal to escape certain death. Is that it then? Where am I? Am I dead? Come join me. Up oh, new quest. Keep like multiplying every time I kill them. Not quite sure. Something in the middle of the room. Help me come closer. Oh, here you are at last. You don't have much time holding on to the time. Drains much of my energy. Who are you? I think I'm scared of you. Not sure other questions, but we need to escape this place first. Watch out, they're already coming back. Who are you talking about? Them, those from the nothingness. Oh. Ah! Uh, I, it wouldn't let me do anything. I like got stun locked. It's annoying. Whoa, big hit. Oh, what do I do? There's so many of them. Eesh. Listen, I'm a warrior and I know nothing about magic. I can't get out of here, but I can try to help find some help. And don't worry. You already helped me. You just don't know it yet. By the ancients, my head is going to explode. Two minds in a single body. Amazing. Uh, <laughs> enough. What? What did you do to me? Our minds are now sharing a single body. Your body, mine is still trapped in its crystal prison for now at least. I don't understand any of this. Then look. Look at the frozen figure standing right before you. Behold the fallen northern king. Attacked and imprisoned here in the Temple of Heroes. How could it be? Uh, later, friend, we must hurry to the Eastern Realm. I can sense the evil coming back already. Prepare for the battle. Oh my god. I'm gonna get overwhelmed. There, that big creature, the magic gate it used to come here is still somewhere around us. Invisible taking control of the creature. <laughs> Take control of enemies that have a special symbol under them. Go to them and press no mouse button. Possess monsters can move and fight just like your hero. You leave the host body if it dies or if you use possess again. Possessed creatures don't drop any items when they die. Go to a big creature now. Ah! Oh my gosh. <laughs> Where's the big creature? Oh, here it is. There we go. Ah, Hulk smash! Oh, this is good. Can I still? There we go. This again. Okay. 
stomping on him. Is there anything specific I have to do? That I wasn't paying attention for? came through the creature's body and crossed through. Okay, so yeah. This looks like the East Desert. Excellent. Chances on our side. I guess I also owe you an explanation. The war bogged down. Weary of seeing my people die, I summoned the other kings to resolve our differences. We met in the Temple of Heroes. A mystical place only accessible by kings. And we managed to come to a peace agreement. We mingled our blood and swore an oath. It was then that the most infamous evil appeared, right inside the temple. It immediately attacked me and imprisoned me in a magic crystal. As a black veil began to descend over me, I saw my allies rush into the fray. I read in you that they survived and managed to return to their realms. But I fear the evil took part of their souls with him, hence their lethargy. You're wondering how I can know all this? Possession. This is the power that allowed you to control the monster. When I enter a corpse, I know everything about it. Its story, its knowledge, its don't you know the old saying? To the east, fire and strength. To the south, water and courage. To the west, earth and wisdom. To the north, wind and spirit. This is my power. Imprisoned in the magic crystal, I slowly regained consciousness. There were dark creatures running around me. The bridge was not sealed. I waited until I regained enough strength. Then, possessing one of them, I extracted my spirit from its cocoon. Then I found you. An agile mind in a strong body. Someone strong enough to help me put an end to all that. Listen carefully. Each realm has a magical portal leading into the Temple of Heroes. But the passage only opens when all four portals are active. The Norse portal should still be active. If we can activate the three others, the passage will open once again, cleansing the Temple of Evil in the process. We will then be able to cross through. And if the gods will it, I shall regain my body. Sorry I had the cursor right here that for so long. I was reading the subtitles and I was not paying attention to the fact that there was a cursor right in the middle of the screen. <laughs> I'm kind of enjoying this game so far. It seems pretty easy. Um, very... Uh, meh. Alright, that's going to be it for today. Um, then we're going to start quest 2 next time. And it looks like it says, Homeland of the Dwarves, the Eastern Realm used to be a dry place filled with sand and rock quarries, the richness of its soil provides inhabitants with resources such as copper, iron, and gold. So, we're going to take care of that next time. Uh, for now, remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Later.